All right, look who's back. Jeepers peepers. I wasn't even gonna film any of this, but then I got to doing this last little sort of silly bit, <clears throat> which is putting on these last few parts. And I don't have any of these uh, bolts. I don't know if you remember from last time, but we put all new, we put all new screws all the way around and anywhere we could, and we put on new grub screws. And I did find a little, after a little cleanup of my space, I did, those are the old uh, grub screws. A couple of people asked me where I got the grub screws from. Honestly, I pulled them off an old bridge that was in, like, perfect condition. Just a generic, no-name sort of strat bridge. So I pulled those out, and those are in there. But yeah. That's the old rusty look. Those were hard to get off. Fuck's sakes. There we go. Yeah, those were hard to get off. Anyway, so more rust. And the only reason I'm turning on the camera is because I finally had a brilliant little idea. And some of you are probably going to laugh. But I thought, oh, you know what? This is totally going to work. So all I've done, and you've probably seen other guys do stuff like this, I just chucked up the uh, little screw in my drill. I keep a little bin of old sandpaper bits around here. So then I just got to 400. There we go, it's starting to clean up. Nice. And then I can just pull it up out of my chuck and it's looks nice and Nice and new again. Well, not new, but not rusty and gross. Neat. I like the little sort of brushed look it gives it too. That's kind of neat. Um, so yeah, that's all really. That's the only reason I'm turning the camera on. This guitar is back for uh, shielding. We're putting this mint green pickguard onto it. So I've already obviously done almost all of what I need to do here. Alright. Good enough continuity. Alright. <laughs> 